This is a 34, this is a 28. I don't know if it's gonna fit, but I'm gonna put it on first and uh, give it a try. A lot of the times they recommend you not to try it, not to put it on because it's not the same thing. Shops always advise you against it, but in my case I'm gonna give it a try, see if it works. To be able to change this, you need a special key. It's a Shimano and the key looks like this. So this is a key and this key goes in here and then you can remove that entire uh, mechanism off. The easiest way is to put it in the vise and just turn it. It is counterclockwise, so the thread on the wheel is counterclockwise, very, very important. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna turn it counterclockwise. It's fixed in the vise. It should allow us to take it off. There it is. And then it will need a little bit of a force, but with confidence because it's counterclockwise. This one, it just goes in and then the chain, the strength of the chain will just screw it into place. So here we go, going up the hill with my new sprocket. It is doing very, very well. About 20% less speed, but 20% more torque. The gears work really, really well. They shift really, really well. In my case, uh, it was a $10 upgrade that was really, really worth it. Thanks for watching, and let me know what you think at the bottom.